itself. We have an answer that is stronger than death itself. Jesus Christ. He is awesome. He is so awesome that he overcame death itself. That he said, you know what? I've been there. I've done that. I get it. And I overcame it. Do, do we know anyone else who has overcame death itself like Jesus Christ did? Because he did. And it's interesting in you today. There's a, there's a motive as well for his resurrection of death and his love for you. His, his powerful love for you. There was a reason for it. It wasn't just like meaningless, like some of our doctrines where we think Christianity is a load of bob, right? So it's just so our, our life is meaningless. The creation of where we come from is meaningless. That's no reason. Jesus had a reason to kill death itself. Because we do need a hope right now, don't we? That's greater than death itself. We need a hope when death is staring us in the face or even takes our life. Where you say, I don't give a rip, mate. I don't give a rip. I'm not bothered. I don't care. Take my life. Because I got Jesus in my heart. I got Jesus in my heart. I got Jesus in my heart. And there ain't nothing that's going to destroy that. There ain't nothing that's going to beat that. We do, don't we? Not even. We need something greater than death itself. And it's Jesus Christ. He's awesome. He's the answer to everything. And I pray as you're walking by today, from everything that comes from us, that you would receive. Jesus Christ in your life and you find purpose and identity and everlasting love and that when when you die when you come to death itself when you face in death itself through, through old age or sickness or in an accident when you're facing death you can laugh at it and say you know what bro come at me because I've got Jesus that's what you can say to death God bless you Nottingham and I pray you receive him in your heart today receive the message of Jesus Christ and get yourself to heaven for eternity. Amen.